The buildup of steam under pressure can cause many things to go off. But how about a water heater bursting right through your house? To mimic a real-life situation, the roof of the house has been constructed to California Building Code specifications. And the water heater contains no explosives. They turn on the power, hunker down, and wait. You feel ready? Everyone's in position? Cameras are all rolling? Yeah. We've got a nice little red house out there sitting on there, you know, like everything's rosy. Rosy on the outside, but roasting on the inside. Okay, everybody, we're at 300 PSI. That's twice the tank rating. Keep your eyes peeled. As the pressure inside the tank mounts, so does Jamie and Adam's heart rate. 315 PSI. Oh, this is killing me. 320. Any second. 325. This is excruciating. This kind of stress on a regular basis can't be good. For no. You. Shortening our lifespan. <laughs> We're going to make it to 350. the heater launches and tears through the roof like it's tissue. You could practically have a three-course meal while you're waiting for it to come back down. <laughs> Look at the house! What house? I don't see a house. I don't know what you're talking about. This actually surprised me. The house was no hindrance whatsoever to the rocket. It probably would have gone through several houses like this before it stopped going. It's like a fairy tale come true. The water heater huffed, it puffed, and it blew the house down. It just goes to show you, you know, there's danger everywhere. Did you know what was lurking in your basement? The guys inspect what's left of their once charming home. The bottom of the tank went from concave to convex, probably in a split second. There's a hole in the roof. It had to go through two layers of two by four trusses in order to make that hole, and yet it totally did. And it did it without breaking any of the three windows in here. That's a rocket, my friend. Yeah. Not a bomb. The trajectory and form of the 500-foot-high rocket-like blast is revealed on the high speed. I got to say, it's more interesting than an actual explosive explosion uh -huh. because this steam is just erupting everywhere and, and completely disintegrating. It's different. It's more elegant. Yes, it was like a lovely, delicate water heater ballet, uh, but deadly.